Pterodactyl, also known as pterosaur, was a type of prehistoric flying reptile that lived during the Mesozoic era about 150 million years ago. Although often called a dinosaur, it was not a true dinosaur as it belonged to a separate group of reptiles known as pterosaurs. Pterodactyls were the first vertebrates to evolve the ability to fly and were some of the largest flying animals to have ever lived. Pterodactyls ranged in size from small to very large, with wingspans ranging from just a few inches to over 30 feet. They had long, narrow wings that were supported by a single bone, called the pteroid, which extended from their wrists. These wings were covered in a thin layer of skin, similar to a bat's wing. The rest of their body was covered in feathers or fur-like fibers, which helped to keep them warm. Pterodactyls had long, pointed beaks that they used to catch fish and other small animals. They had sharp teeth that were used to hold on to their prey and tear it apart. Their eyes were very large and faced forward, giving them excellent vision and depth perception. This was important for hunting, as they needed to be able to spot and catch their prey in midair. Pterodactyls were able to fly by using their wings to create lift, just like modern birds. However, their flight was very different from that of birds, as they did not have a keel, which is a bone that helps to anchor the muscles that power the wings. Instead, they had a large breastbone that was designed to help them launch themselves into the air. Once in flight, they used their wings to glide and soar on air currents. Despite being one of the most successful groups of animals in history, pterodactyls eventually went extinct around 66 million years ago, along with the dinosaurs. Scientists are still trying to understand why they disappeared, but it is thought to be due to a combination of factors, including climate change, competition from other animals, and disease. That's all for today's lesson. Please subscribe if you like this video. Goodbye.